and gentlemen, this is Wildcats 174. It is our second to last show before we head into pure engagement. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I am Hickey Worldwide, joined by Robert McNichol. Hello. And he's back, he's back, he's back at last. Hello, sir. Hi, you Morgan. Hello, everyone. It's been a while. Uh, a lot Where of the fuck have you been? I have been making a lot of changes to my personal life, but now... I have finally gotten a bit of a break. I am here, back on the commentary desk, where I belong. Oh, well, how bad did you piss up Alicia to, for, for, for you to be saying that? Uh, 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 Alright, we're, we're keeping things personal on the down low, alright? You just worry about your job <laughs> and Wildcats right now. Well, this is the show I get paid for doing here in the DC, so I'm pretty safe on here. Let me guess, well, you've, we, been you've been sleeping in the guest house these past couple of weeks. We don't, we're not talking about that. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, uh, ignoring that, we gotta get started. We got a stack night here tonight for Wildcats 174. We are inching closer to pure engagement. A uh, main event, ladies and gentlemen, later on tonight, we see the return to Wildcats with Nicole Natasha. She takes on Alan B. Barton in tonight's Wildcats 174 main event. But we open Wildcats 174 with Wildcats Tag Team Action. Thank you. Um, well, get crunky in. <laughs> uh, it's about to get crunky, it's about to get funky, it's about to get dancing. Uh, it's a 2-5-1. A 2 five, one. Go ahead, Saya. Uh, what? Go ahead. Go on. Take oh. it. I was gonna say the two five one, one of the most uh, notoriously uh, fun groups here on the Wildcats division. Uh, we got Rocks, we got Tori. Um, oh, uh, Tori, Valentine, and Natty Rocks. Yeah, but making their way down to the ring. I don't know what in the hell is in that cup. I think they got that same cup from uh, Woodcrest Finest. Again, I don't know what the hell these people in the back are are serving here in catering. Hey, you could, hey, you could say your boys, uh, the Cash Money Hooligans from the time ago, Kevin Again, Jay. I don't know where they get half the stuff they got come, where, where it comes from. They got a fucking gorilla in my company, and I still don't know where to return that to. Oh, the, the, the gorilla you sound before Roxy Hayes. That was not by choice. <laughs> It shouldn't be, uh, and the other one shouldn't be by choice. No. But uh, the two five one set for a test. I know that. As is. we hear Neil Diva Revolution music. Ah, uh, this takes me back. Oh, look Whoa. at the name oh, though. New, new name change. Paradigm. Paradigm. Uh, the team of Billy Rulu and uh, Lexi Blue going under the term Paradigm now, as we all know, they broke off, as you remember, from Shakeen Furia. Mm -hmm. I'm, being, I'm, being told to, I'm being called by production, so one of you leave. Look, when you, have, right. when you have stayed along with someone for so long, sometimes it's time for a bit of a change. Of fantasy, which, uh, you know, Paradigm have done in, in uh, no, going... Thanks. Wildcats. Basically, they said that they told her that they wanted to focus more on more outside of what they've been doing and wanted to be a better tag team in the Wildcats. Division. And she said, okay, go for it. Spread your wings. Well, and by the way, this is still one of the best teams in Wildcats history. Two-time Wildcats tag team champions, I believe. Yes. Gonna go three. You never know. And we're starting off here. Meanwhile, the 251 yet to have won a tag title belt here in Wildcats, though being very successful. Oh, God! Oh, Bailey with the cheap shot. You can see how that pissed off Maddie right there. Bailey yeah, just laughs it off. Tell him, Miniwall. Yeah, tell I him, did. Tell him, Miniwall, they're doing a damn job. Pay attention to the action. Oh, shot it to nice. the back. What Bailey, is this? Pump handle oh. backbreaker. Pump handle backbreaker. It's gonna be a very interesting contest because oh, uh, like while they uh, might not be the newest tag team on the block, they are one of the newer. Is the two five one. However, 
paradigm has been a tag team for well over half a decade at this point. Oh, it's a long tag uh, team, I believe, on the Wildcats brand. Yes. So, like, they, they're, they're long time veterans here within DC. I know they had a season or two off, but they are long time veterans here within Indeed. this not us, if we can be honest. Nice up cut from Bailey Ruru. Kick from Tori, he'll send it right down. Now he in. Now he rocks. Kick from Maddy. Head scissors, DDT! That was the most unique head scissors I've ever seen. And now into an arm bar. Oh, uh, we have got some more information. Oh, uh, Lexi going back, uh, Lexi uh, from now on, uh, I need to correct myself. No, no calling her Lexi Blue anymore, she's going by her real name. Lexi Sakona. 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 Alright. Bit, bit of Samoan heritage, I believe, in that name. Well then. I guess she's on her, she's, uh, she's respecting her, fa her family's lit. Her family then. Okay. Yeah, I'm all for it. That's a cool offer. And then comes Lexi Sakona right now. The Samoan and French connection. Oh. Laroe is French, isn't it? I, I get that. Uh, yeah. That's uh, interesting, actually. The French and Simone connection. That, that's a good that's a good one. Now be a thing in the future when John Blackos finds a hot Simone and Wifey. <laughs> we've been trying, to, sorry. We've been trying to sorry. We've been trying to sorry. We've been trying to find him a hot Simone and Wifey for like two seasons. Oh, here's so, well, I'm waiting well, for this. I'm, wait, one, I'm waiting for the series finale. To be quite honest, I'm, I'm sorry <laughs> that dig, that dig right there was too easy not to take. True, and also don't forget later on tonight we have a title match here on Wildcats 174. But we have a title match on the And yeah, that's what I've heard from the guys in the back. Okay, uh, well, fine. I know, I know, I know. Later on tonight we've got Trixie. Uh, oh yeah, we got uh, Yumiko versus Carol Capondelli for the for the Rising Star title later on tonight. Look at Robert. Okay, what we saw last time they fought, they this is going to get very ugly. Look at Robert yeah. getting all the scoops from the dirt sheet. Hey, hey, oh. talk, to, talk to the monkeys in the back. Don't don't talk to me. Yeah, I, I have know. a feeling you're uh, talking nice to Meltzer. Meltzer. That's who you're talking to. I uh, wish last... I could talk to Meltzer. By the way, something else we should mention dead quick before we all get into crazy. Remember, uh, Bondera recovering from the DDT on the pure mahogany table as uh, as uh, Sakon gets uh, assaulted in the corner. And powerbomb out of it from Natty Rock. Something else we should mention, by the way, about to, uh, about you know the uh, Wildcats tonight. Uh, Trixie Decker back on Wildcats tonight. She'll be going against one of those privileged generation assholes. Oh, she wins. Oh my god. Oh, but no, I'm sure you. I'll do it. I, I kind of expected. I'll, 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 say, no, I, I, I'll save it from the match. I, I kind of expected yeah. knowing that you would never know a type of lifestyle that the privileged society live in anyway. Considering that you are a dirty grit. So in a way, I can't blame you. I don't know. I want to hurt this. I want to. I want to hurt this. But I think of think of you, right? I want to hurt this man. I want to as well. But anyway, oh, Tracy Decker is going to make her Wildcats return, taking on one of those three pricks. And from what I've heard from Lucina, uh, if she wins, she's going to be added to the to the goddess title choose, match. No, she gets to choose the title match. Not she added. Choose. Choose. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, my God! <laughs> Natty just speared the comb down. Oh, and also, Michelle, she's... Uh, I think she might be in action here tonight. Because of uh, yeah. what she said last week. Yeah. yeah, I know. I want to puke as well. It's a kick to the back. But we'll focus on that when we get the... As we know, this mm. Wildcats tag team division this year is picking place. Well, as we know, those privileged stars with Michelle's two underlings. I've actually got a Wildcats tag team title shot now. Thanks to going up to the board. You, you going See behind that because the... I value my job. Woo! Yeah. No? Which means upcoming up pure engagement, it will be those two uh, underlings of Michelle Rockford 
it's uh, and the privilege obsession. against American Obsession. And if and if so, I have thought my bias this year in the last American Obsession match was bad. Oh, oh, oh forget about it. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be in that same boat as well. Woo! Anyway, Rock. I mean, Arena. Arena and Danielle get the shots put. Let's go, Ellie and Envy. And I can't wait to hear what Ellie and Envy will have to say you know, about them later on. You know, there's a saying about two, two wrongs. I mean, two lefts don't make a right. Oh, Call breaker. Or the two, it's two lefts, two wrongs don't make a right. But you get what I'm saying. Oh, Billy missed the split leg drop. Yeah, that's a bad. That, she, she, yeah, she literally split herself. It's wishbone. Oh, I'll roll the leg. Go ahead, Zaya. I'll let you finish your point. No, I'm just Kick saying. I'm just saying. Just because you root for one team because you don't like the other doesn't mean, mean that. Me doesn't mean the other team is exempt from all the crappy things that they've done. Let me be clear, I called out the controversy behind the blokes with, you know, the arcade of the basketball. Lexi almost missed it though, Natty almost got the win. But let's be clear, they won the belts for and squirt redemption. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, they did They won on fur and squirt. Well, I, be I, a man! Well, I said be all, a man. Man. I said it. all right! Just say it. I said all right! If that's the perspective that you see it from, then I can't do that. Oh, you fucking you you are you are an you are something else to higher Morgan. Like, anyway, I bet you right. I bet you right now. If 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 American Session didn't win those tag titles, we will not hear the end of you bitching and moaning and whining and crying about. Well, let, let me be clear about this, because because let me be clear. This ain't even directed at MP Price. He, he's hating with MP Price, although he probably hates her because of who she's dating. His hate is with Ellie Rose. He won't give Ellie Rose a single ounce. Inch of fucking credit within this world. Oh, oh God! I don't hate Ellie. Oh, all right? Really? I'm disappointed in Ellie. I'm disappointed that I put so much time and effort in. That's not where my thing comes from. An effort. Look, man. Oh my God! What time and effort? I was, I was on the Ellie bandwagon as well, but then I started to see the light. I saw the light. Oh, God, Bailey with oh, a DDT on the floor. So close to the, 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 to the ring attendants here. Oh, yeah. by the way, we should mention that we all know with PCA tag team matches this season, no count outs. Mm. So they can fight their own night. Yeah, they can. All I'm going to say in response to Sahaya Morgan is, because he was the thing, he never jumped on the Ellie Rose train, he jumped on the Destiny Williams train when those two had the match at that redemption pre-show. I believe it was 2017, if I'm correct, 2018, one of those years. Yes, I believe it was and you, 2018. And he, said, and he said, make sure Destiny Williams is never on a pre-show ever again. He said that shoot backstage to the wall, by the way, I was there. Yes. Because I was moving in next, I was moving in like... Oh, because good, MTB, good. Because, because MTB had put his notice in. Mm. Still didn't, and even though Destiny was great in that match, still didn't show any appreciation for early roles then, and still doesn't know. Right. So that's all I need to say. Yeah, he finally did. Oh, oh my. Power from the They're still fighting here with the ring attendant. Bailey finally tried to get back into the ring here. That, 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 poor ring, that poor ring announcer ring beller has got to be scared out of their lives with that much action going on. Oh, what the oh, hell? hell? Oh, that's a cheap shot. It was a cheap shot. Uh-oh. Here comes Tori. Oh, wait. Oh, he's got the arm. Oh! It's it. One of these teams could be that much closer to a tag title opportunity with a victory here tonight in our opening contest. Oh! You know, Bailey went for the cheap shot on Tori and it failed that title. Oh, look out. Oh, Jeez. goodness. Go ahead. Five one. You already said it. If you're so close to getting a shot, but it just hasn't worked out for them, you need to start getting on a roll. You know, mm -hmm. paradigm looking to possibly come. I think first time for the time. DCA tattoo champion. I mean, DCA yeah. tattoo champion. Yeah, no, what? 
Well, let's be clear, no one on Wildcats has been a three-time champion. Obviously, that record got shattered this year on, you know, take down. I don't talk. I don't want to talk about. Don't it, talk about. Don't talk about it unless you are contractually obligated to. Oh we, well, we are because we were kind of bringing up the free time argument, okay? Because mm. we know that was that was uh, that was done by a world champion this Wait, year. What in the hell is this wheelbarrow? What the hell? Oh, oh God! I can modify. I can modify death sentence. What? Two, no. Oh, I, 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 I barely ran into a super kick from Tommy right wait, there. Wait, 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 wait. One, One two, two. No. Credit to Natty Rocks for kicking out there twice. I don't think Tommy could believe it. Oh, God. Jeez. No. Probably should think of a different strategy here. Oh, she got it that time. Oh! Turns her around. Oh my! Fine on the pine. Yeah, and it, and it doesn't feel fine. Oh, got King Kong! Oh, me. Change of the unchanged oh. gorilla. No, nope. we're gonna miss. Oh God! Oh. Back elbows Back here. elbows. And, oh! Right to the, all to the back of that. Here comes Tori Valentine now. But she immediately gets stopped. Mm -hmm. The ropes. Who says? Oh. Yes. And now just driving her head. Yeah, Paradigm. Nice. Paradigm are in full control right now. And you, and you can see it here. Back to Simone now, looking for yeah. the corner. Oh, oh, takes a kick from Tori. Roll through, through oh. the ropes, kick from the spine. Double kick. Ruthless Tori Valentine Jesus. on the knee! Right on the knee. Oh, shoot. My bloody Valentine. Oh, be the knee No, no. Oh, she went for it. Nobody home. I'll put her into the corner. Oh, this ain't good. Oh, wait, no. It's oh. not. Off the rope. What in the Oh, she oh. missed! The back oh! Big time shoulder block. Tori's in a lot of trouble I here. Oh, big shot. He is. Oh, three elbows. Oh! Now, oh, close Whoa, line! Oh, what a shot! Nearly taking her out. Oh, nice. Yeah, she almost did. Alright, she's into the corner. Oh, wait a second. Tag out to Natty. Stop paying attention. There's a draw kick to the side of the head. Oh, I'm look at that. There's a jawbreaker. Now, now, top. Oh. on top of Lexi here. Oh, there's the, there's the face buster. Yeah. Natty could be on the verge of victory here, dragging Lexi away from the ropes. And I'm going to work Again on that. Again on the leg. leg. Oh, wait a minute. Uh oh. Oh, no. no. Quick bell to belly, though, from like she the corner and she just sent. Sorry, Valentine, great dual team last turn up looking to clear. Uh-oh. Great. We're gonna go for that, that death sentence thing? Yes, uh, they are. Like yeah. They're going for it again. Assisted it will be a leg drop, Bulldog. No, Tori Valentine in sight. And this one is over. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna give a name. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna throw out a name for that thing. It's called the paradigm. I'm gonna shift call that. You know, ironically, let's call it the paradigm shift. No, we can't call it the paradigm shift. How are we down the thing? Paradigm effect? Sure. Yeah. Because once, sure. Yeah. Work. Because that that doesn't get a C by AEW. 
I'm gonna never call it a foundation because fuck that lot. Fuck, fuck <laughs> Mrs. Smith. Yes. Yeah, let's call it the paradigm. Let's call it the paradigm effect. I like that. Hashtag fire that motherfucker, and I'm still promoting that three years later. Hashtag justice for Sagat. It's the finish right here. That paradigm effect. That wheelbarrow leg drop. And bang. Ah. That was out like a oh, light. Corey oh, couldn't, oh, couldn't do a dang oh, thing. Paradigm's coming for those three. Number three, three time DJ Wildcats tag team title reigns. Never been done, but it could chasing be. His chasing history. Well, it looks like uh, Kimberly Page made her statement clear and we got some more competition for our women's title. Yep. Yeah, Kira Suzuki, as we all know, who, you know, coming off the car, All-Stars, you, you know, women's title, you know, women's rumble back at Car All-Stars. Right. Well, she's, she's keeping her eye out on, on the competition here. She, she knows everything that's going on. Oh. No one fair to her. Because she's going to. She's got a big opportunity for that call starts from the championship when that time arrives. Ladies and gentlemen, the jinx is back on Wildcats. She's got some new gear. She jinx herself, Trixie Decker making her Wildcats return. Oh, as I stated, former SCA World Tag Team champion with her best friend Envy at the principal. Wait, 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 why are you going all Jesus? Ah, it's an oh, oh, tricks. 
<laughs> kind you of. remember the last time? Or you remember the last time you kind of dismissed that girl? I didn't dismiss uh. her. Look, I'm just saying, the way things are looking, I don't know if this is such a good idea. Oh, I think it's a great oh. idea. Because she gets but. to beat the shit out of one of these three. By the way, as we all know, Trixie is still stated to face a catchy honor, Joe, of pure engagement. Speaking of which... Alright, all right. here it comes. Let's see. Here comes the pa here comes the fanboy. Oh, he's right! Let's listen into... You, you, this is all you! Never yeah, will be quiet. Go ahead. I still... Uh, you want to... You, you want a fun boy outside? Go ahead. I swear to God, you have a knack to, for wanting to be with people who don't even want to even be within 30 feet oh of you. Oh my God, you dumbass. That's not the point. No, 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 no. No, shut the oh, no, fuck no, up. No, 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 Robert, 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 let him go. Let him go. The holy pinnacle of professional wrestling is here, right in front of your faces. Right in front of that is wrestling royalty on the left of her two opponents. Irina, Nakari, and Danielle Winters. Together they make up the privileged society. I thought the, I thought the ACW one was bad. Michelle yeah. Rockford has taken these two fine specimen of athletes under her wing and have together have made a new trio that is destined for absolute greatness here in Wildcats. Zahaya, do you even know what the words are saying out of your mouth or are you just literally talking out of your ass? You know what this team reminds me of? You know what this team reminds me of? The Foundation. Go ahead. We all foundation. know the Foundation. Jonathan Gresham. Ring of Honor! Honor. This is exactly what this team is like. No, they are nowhere near the foundation! Pure and complete pro wrestling to a T. You, you are literally talking shit. I am Morgan. There's a difference between these cunts and the foundation. The foundation has honor. They have dignity. They have class. These three don't! I can't you. Sit on you again, and, la and laugh! Again, Robert, I don't expect anyone who doesn't. I wouldn't expect you to know what class and dignity is, considering that you don't Robert, have. We need, class Robert, we need to calm. Robert, we need to calm down. I've just been handed this note. I know who's fucking doing this shit. Look at this note. Whatever the privileged society are right here, y'all. Ladies and gentlemen, the lead commentator for the match is Sahaya Morgan. <laughs> oh, no, 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 you know what? Fuck this. Fuck this. Fuck this. Fuck Oh, this is... Stop This up. is, uh... Oh, God, he's gonna get fined. Well, well, it's very professional. Oh, God. Very professional, Robert. Because now we get to see the newest... I think that it is Not only the newest member of... The Privilege Society, but the newest member of the Wildcats roster, Daniel Winters. And he's being dragged back today. Like Trixie Decker. Look, I, I, I like Trixie, alright? <laughs> alright, I'm not going to sit here and dismiss Trixie Decker after everything I've seen from her, but she represents a certain style of professional wrestling that I just can't get behind. I'm Daniel to the floor. And by the way, by the way, this is more bullshit. This is handed down from Dakota from, uh, and from Tiger. One Tiger, you listening to this? I said I don't like you on social media before, and I get it. Oh! Business is business, okay? But don't start making stuff personal. Two, two, and don't consider that for it. That's just me saying the truth. You make it personal with me, fine. I'll make it personal back with you. Two, oh, this is coming from Dakota. It's going from the car to Christy Stan to get his hands into this fucking brand. And if he gets his hands into this brand, then we're all fucked. Is that it? snake in the grass needs to fucking go. This is a very extreme reaction to me doing a 
Primitive Society is out here for a game. I was saying last episode, Chris is starting to get his claws in this brand. And it's not good for anyone. Oh, uh, Danielle with a picture perfect suplex. Floats over into the company. See how nice he had her, her shoulders pinned to the mat with pinpoint precision. That is how you can tell a pure, 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 pure that, that, wrestler right that, there. That, that, that right there, the eye right. What, what are you talking about? Oh, he's going for the. She's obviously trying to go for a face lock here. Didn't have quite a good grip uh, on I, it. I, I, as a high, I'm back. I have a legit question to ask from you. Have you been being? Have you been dr being uh, suffocated from air from all the times you've been sat on by your wife? Be careful. You can't be too outspoken because he has to read right here. Whoa! <laughs> Still going for Trixie. One. One. I swear to God, this, I feel like this is just torture. This is punishment. What are you talking about? You punishment need to see the finest pure professional wrestling on earth right in front of you. You're treating this like it's a bad thing. She is no... These three are nowhere near pure wrestling. All they are are nothing more than entitled bitches. Well, one of those entitled bitches is a former TCA goddess champion and a veteran and a mainstay talent here on the Destiny Championship Alliance roster for yeah, over what, 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 seven what? years. Wait, 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 Are you serious? We're being, told we have to keep, we're, we're being told we have to keep it, keep it in PG while these three are on, <laughs> otherwise we get fans. <laughs> are you fucking kidding me? Since when did DCA become U UCWL? Oh my god, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm literally gonna scream. We're basically, I want to scream we're right now, but I can't. We're basically watching future Wildcats tag team champions. Daniel Winters in this match. And we are, and we're, and you guys are being unprofessional as all hell right <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I'm literally, I'm literally being, to, I'm really, literally being punished for what I said in the past to the VW board of directors. Maybe I'm even though I've apologized and, and tried to re and, and try to maintain professionalism. This, is, uh, but maybe they have just finally had enough of your biased commentary and your obvious sexism towards the privileged society. Season? Yes. <laughs> I hate everything. What the I hell hate everything. Feel right now? I'm gonna cry. I'm literally gonna cry. Uh, 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 if you get a fine for that. If you guys think you, 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 you say something. Oh, well, you get a fine, but you guys get suspended for this game as well. Mm. Oh, great. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, to, to the VW Board of Directors, thank you. Thank welcome you to for, Roman. Thank you for. Oh, thank well, you for welcome, welcome, welcome to Roman Battle. Since I kind of went for another liaison, I have no idea your bullshit, buddy. Such a class. I want Roman to take it. Go on, Roman. Peace. Look, I look. I have. I have no problem. I don't. I kind of expect this from Roman, considering all of it. His grubby little hands gets gets into on a weekly yeah. basis. Nick, you ain't too pretty to get your ass knocked out. Daniel Winters currently working over Trixie's arm. Because now you get to see like this. Going right after the arm tip. Takes her down. That's nice strength. And then drops all the way on top of the right arm of Trixie Decker. Continuing the limb work by going for a nice cattle um, mutilation. Got both arms um, hooked here. Uh, I, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, Roman, but Taggart figured you would say that, so he made a note saying that he, he won't punish you, but he might might not give your brother a world title. <laughs> okay. I mean, all those world title match sounds just about as good. There are always opportunities. Oh! Anything, I'm not losing out. Kick to the back of the head and he's just shot him with him. Trixie 
Roxy now trying to go up to the top rope here. I guess when I said my thing, you know, I say what I say, and I don't care. I don't give two shits about what, who, who I piss off. So I guess it's coming back to haunt me. And honestly, oh my I wasn't goodness. prepared for it. A sort of illegal use of the ropes there from Fitzy. Referees are really start imploring the rules here to get both oh, to women that was a in the ring. They, the match is supposed oh, to take place in and, the ring. And yeah. Arena is distracting Trixie. Well, maybe Trixie should stop having conversations with the, with the other opposing side. Now, Danielle takes the button to do the snap, though. Oh, well, she's swung and a miss, though. I, nice jump to the goal. That was Trixie. a closed fist grab. You gotta watch those. I swear to God, I, I feel like Trixie. I'm the only one who cares about the sanctity of professional wrestling. Unless it's with these three. The Privileged Society are trying to bring it back. Rick C! Goes it for him! That's a heat seeking missile. Again, another illegal use of the ropes there. Again, the back is supposed to be getting she didn't, inside and placed inside on the ring. You know what? Look, I, I'm going to be as trying to be as professional as I am because I'm still young in this business and I still want to actually try to make a name for myself. So. I'm just gonna be as professional as I can. Oh, wait a minute. Trixie but, gonna bend Daniel Snow right here. Stunt and, right and, and make it do a foot. Alright, okay. Not something I really expected, but it, it works out. Oh! Huh. Now, Aaron, I obviously, turnbuckle padding coming a bit loose here. Referee. Finally having to do his job, Aaron telling him, telling him to do his job for him. Ritzy trying to pick up Danielle for a slam book, Danielle at the back. I mean, honestly, I can't wait until the privilege, uh, privilege generation all leave the goal after the Just to see you all complain about If that happens, I'll... Gladly, I'll gladly. You know what? You'll I'll gladly say what? Complain? As I said? No. No. No, I'll do one better. Come. If the privileged generation Win. wins the win gold. And if they do it clean, admit it. I'll say what you mean what you want me to say and that they're good. Okay? Of course it's gonna be clean, That's Robert. They're the pure generation. Right to the gut though from Trixie. Oh, wait a minute. I just... Oh, she did the deal. Into the up bar. Has her... bar suplex. Oh, wait a second. Don't collect her incoming. Oh, no. Oh, no, oh, yes. no, 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 no. Trixie, 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 no, no. Ow. Oh. Yeah, that hurt. That was a sacrifice to the bone god. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, and a nice kick to the top of that. And now look at this. Shin breaker, courtesy of Danielle Winters. Why? I'm about Drexie fighting back here. A kick to the from Drexie. Drexie now starting to come back here. Oh, no! Big time spine busted Danielle. Retreating into the corner. Oi! Oh my god, snap German suplex! The one, the two, no! The two. But see, they're gonna go up top. Again, another illegal use of the ropes here by Trixie. It's supposed to stay on the mat. Oh, oh and see, that's, that's exactly what happens. And a final driver! As old school as it gets, spiking Trixie into the canvas to go. Danielle continues to put on quite the performance against Trixie! Full Nelson face buster! That, that might be it. 
She only that four. One, two, go! No! Trixie able to get that shoulder up. No one ever said that Trixie was a resilient wrestler. A winner. She's got a lot of heart, she's got a lot of fight here. But we're she talking is a former about, tag team champion. But we're talking about a level of pure wrestling that Trixie just does not have. This. Oh, nice! Got ammo back suplex. Now that was nice wrestling. It was. Um, Trixie and ringing in those kicks. Now, what is this? Hey, that's the top that's spot. Wait! No, 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 no! No, you can't do this! Trixie said, no, 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 The most obvious death spot in car wrestling, the superplex to the goddamn floor! Oh my god! Can't be allowed. This shouldn't be allowed. That's, that's, that's not pure. That's not pure at all. But it's effective. And Michelle letting her go. That's not pure. That's obviously against the rule. It was effective though, and that's all that matters. Oh no! Oh, Mich oh. Michelle. And uh, on the apron. Well, of course, because now she's got to tell the referee how to do his job. Because apparently, the referee doesn't know how to enforce his own rules. Fair, it's hey! oh. What the hell are you doing? Thank you, Thank you, Minnie Walter. You can't do I that! Can't. See you, Michelle! That woman is a former... Take her out right as well! Take her out as well! Take her out right as well! Hey, hey, hey! Wait, wait a minute! Burst up shot in front of the ref! I was in front of the ref. No shot in front of the ref. This is over. Yeah. Obviously, a Trixie, what was that? Obviously, Trixie unable to continue the contest after a, an unfortunate shot to the jaw here. Now, what a breast up shot! Well, I'm here comes I, the, I don't know how many. Oh, here saw, we go. Here we go. No yeah, misgame in effect. Look, I told you that this might not end well for Trixie. And this is uh, ridiculous. And uh, it turns out I was right once again. Uh, uh oh. We just lost the lights. Uh. You hear that? We just lost the lights. Yeah, we did. Oh my god! No, 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 what? No, no, no. Oh no! That's oh, a catch. No. Michelle! Oh, that's Michelle! A catch. Michelle! Michelle! Uh, Michelle! Uh, Michelle! Uh, Michelle! This is way above your pay grade. Michelle, don't turn around. 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 Michelle, Oh yeah, Catchy yes. is here. Okay. Damn psychopath! Michelle didn't need to deal with all that. Guys, what? Trixie's still in the ring. Look left in the ring. Trixie, she was still at the uh, nook shop. Open hand punch. No. Whatever. Oh no. Uh, I don't like this. These two will be at it if you're getting Wait, them to go the light. I think I can buy the. Oh, I. Oh Someone my God. turn the lights back on? What's happening? All right, she's gone. I, th I think Akechi has picked her next target for Akira. And she may want Trixie all to herself. Yeah. yeah. Oh. oh dear.
DLC and fights, this is just like, so much of what we actually do. The training every day, getting up, knowing, oh, I'm sore, I don't want to train, but still doing it. And after training, thinking, I'm so glad I did it. You should respect everybody and you can learn from everybody. It's up to you to find out what it is. What, what can you learn from that guy? If you have that approach, I think your opp opportunities are endless. Someone very much thinks highly of herself. I mean, strong message there from Jamie Fury if we can be clear. We get set for more action here on Wildcats 174 after one that hell just happened there. Who knows? I don't even want to know what that ha what happened. All we know is this, Akechi has ha, has sighted in her next. Uh, here, music, I believe, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for Wildcats 174 main event. Indeed. It's supposed to have a uh, a uh, rising star title match here tonight, but yeah, you can tell us that. You can tell us that. You can tell us that. Nope, yeah. not today. Yeah. Also, you know what happened due to the pure monotony table. Mm -hmm. Anyway, it's main event time. Here comes um, LMB Martin, who set who, who made the request of going into this matchup alone. Out of uh, respect or any to uh, uh, find this thing. This is going to be most interesting if we can be clear. You say that. Mm -hmm. Alan B is a very troubled woman at the moment, which be quite the understatement. He has. Yep. She's, she yeah. has gone through some shit. Congrats, yes, she to, has. congrats to Amber McLean, who's, you know, the new Sirens World Champion. Mm -hmm. But I'll say this right now, give this woman a rightful rematch. That's, well, that's if she decides to show up. Again. But you can tell there's no fun moving here from Alan. No, she's all business here tonight. She came down to that ring and stoic is all hell. Hmm? Anticipate number two. And there is the returning one year as UWL Spax Champion. She celebrated that this week. 
Mm -hmm. Here comes Nicole Natasha. Also has a vested interest in our Wildcats champion. I could be wrong. Spark champion for 305 days here in the PCA Wildcats legend. Yeah. And then also not forget, Colton Tasha is no stranger to Alan and Martin as well. I believe these two faced mm. off one time. It's like, I believe it's not this year, it's the last year's redemption. Yeah. Wildcats tag team titles. However, that whole situation was pretty fucked up. But uh, now she gets to take on Alan in one on one. Not the fun-loving Allenby that we've all come to know and love, but this one a much more uh, focused, to say the least. And um, as we all know, Nicole Natasha has, uh, how do we put it? Nicole Natasha has been, you know, very thing very publicly he's outspoken about the current Wildcats champion in Amber Stevens. Well ladies and gentlemen this is your Wildcats 174 main event it is Alan B. Martin versus Nicole Natasha. What is the mindset of Martin concerning of all the things she's been through as of late knowing that her friend Aki basically basically tied to the hip with Akira Akira and all that you know? Well, she's been having to deal with this for over a year. A whole year yeah. she's had to deal with this. I mean, it's not gotten any better for her or her relationship with Aki. So I, I really couldn't tell you what it would be like to be in Alan B's shoes right now. I really can't. Nobody can't. Nobody can. If if any a sane man goes through the same stuff that Alan B has been through, they would be locked in a mental asylum. We've seen friendships ended, careers ended, brotherhood, sisterhoods broken. It's what happens here in the Destiny Championship Alliance over the years. However, when that bell rings, those relationships kind of have to be put to the wayside. You gotta get your, you gotta get your head in the game, especially when you're going up against a woman like Nicole Natasha, who is no stranger to the main event scene. Allenby has got to find her groove again. Side headlock takedown exactly. by Nicole. Both women going back and forth here, exchanging holds to start off this contest. Indeed. Yeah. Allenby into the side headlock. Oh! oh! Well, Allenby said she had a number, but apparently she just caught a forearm instead. Yeah. She did. And now, Allen B throws the cone to the ropes. Leaf frogs. Whoa. Ducks under. Oh, it's oh, a small pockets. package. Small package. One. Just the one. Down. One down off of that. One of the many things uh, that we could come to see from Allen B that we usually wouldn't have seen from her back in the day had a little bit of trash talking there. A little bit more vicious side of Allen B that we are now starting to see. And getting a bit a lot mm -hmm. more cockier to say the least. These are pretty much begging Nicole to get back into the ring. Guys, you two just load it now. I've got to take some uh, WWE away business for a few minutes here. Alright. Go ahead. Well, it's me and, me and Zahaya back, um, holding down the fort. Clean break there from Nicole and, uh, and Allenby. Sideways slot here. Behind. Get down to the to the headlock. Light scissors here. Nicole now it's out of it. side headlock. Get to the side headlock. Allenby gets out of it. Now gets in hers. Out to a key lock. Both the lock. Oh. Both these women just going but. tit for tat in the early exchanges of this match. Either one gaining a clear advantage so far. 
Should have been oh. back and forth so far in the early. That's a heavy knee strike there from the Cole. Ah, and a swinging neck breaker. Oh, goodness gracious. Falls right into a body splash. Only gets a one count, though. Man, like we said, it's just been back and forth between these two. And remember, Nicole Natasha yeah, is the current holder of the Rumble Roses case, which she can use any time for a Wildcats championship match. That she can. And we know for a fact that Nicole very much wants to make up for her first time as Wildcat champion, considering all of the complications and controversy that, that came with. Mm -hmm. Martin Alan be trying it. Yeah, Alan be staying on top of Nicole right now. Got her a front face lock. Has her raised the arm, takes her down, and drops the leg. So far, this has been very technical cover here. Just seems like both women trying to get a feeling out process here in the middle of the ring. Trying not to make a mistake, but oh. now Alan be going on the attack here. Punch is raining down, and there's a big time European uppercut. Now Allen B's picking up the pace to hurt their advantage, but Nicole stops that for the time being. That just pretty much stopped her momentum before it could truly get running. Mm -hmm. Now in the middle, oh, Rockers! Good gun drop kick. Jesus. Straight to the chest, Nicole fired up. Looks the like here. Mm -hmm. We walked it down, only getting a one. It's the one count off of that. Oh, well, caught Allenby. Pushed away. Has her. Oh. No, oh, no, she doesn't. Oh. She's thinking for an. Northern Lights. Snap! Northern Lights suplex. One, two, no. That's the two count off of that. Now, full of us. Big time forum smash. And another. Rocking Allenby with these forearms. But it's not a good position, or so I thought Allenby had the reversal. Allenby now getting a full run up to the other side of the ring. Oh, oh my god. That had to hurt. She nearly took the damn head off with that Yakuza kick, but Nicole responding with that head scissors. Indeed, cover here. And he walked way out of position there. With the two count. Gonna cost Nicole some precious time. Mm -hmm. Both women so accomplished in their careers. Alan oh. at one point will pretty much people figure she's going to be the face of this division without a doubt. So all the hockey stuff started to happen and that just kind of halted itself. Derailed it. Yeah. Nicole, a lot of people, again, it's the same thing. It like a lot of people believe that she was like, it looked like she was going to be the next top star. Cover off the crossbody. One, two, no. But then the whole Wildcats championship thing just didn't plan out. And then she just kind of lost her status yeah. in, the, in the main event scene. And, and now she's just slowly but surely getting back up there. And she, yeah, I agree, but now back to the matchup. She's now eating the boot oh my God. of Allen B. Martin. Allen B's actually choking out. Nicole, Natasha there. Yeah, yeah while well, she was against the ropes. That is not something we usually see from Allen B. It could be the frustrations of what's been going on with her coming into effect. Yeah, you might, act, you might actually have a point there. That's and, but unfortunately, that's a double-edged sword. Yes, you can show off more aggression, but that leads to more mistakes in the in the ring. Right now, she's a, she's completely on top of Nicole. She's hoping that she Indeed, she is. Keep that ball rolling. And now, look at the oh, she's got her up against the ropes now, using the ropes to her advantage. It's literally trying to pop out the um, shoulders of um, Nicole and Natasha there. Now, L and B. Oh, oh Jesus! Jesus Christ! What a clothesline! Cactus, cactus clothesline there. Uh, she's not done. She's on the apron. She got it. 
in line here. Oh, jeez. Running senton takes down Nicole on the thinly padded floor. And it's thinly padded, too. Now Allen be going to the top rope here. Has Nicole in her sights. Calling her back to her feet here. Nicole in a bad way. What is Albie thinking? Oh, she got caught. Oh, she tried to go for the crossbody again. She, oh, Nicole oh. saw it coming and tossed her with the fall away slam. Now Nicole's taking advantage of this. Ah, oh, knee drop. King Kong knee drop. And she's not finished just yet. She's gonna double up here. Oh, time oh. elbow. Puts the lag, the one, the two, will that be enough? No, it will not. No. Just imagine he did. So Nicole's project gets to win here tonight. But it can be tainted because of the fact of what uh, Allen B's going through, or will it not? I mean, well, I don't know. Mm -hmm. at, at this point, both women have taken the match. Nicole knew what she was doing for something. Both Allen knew what she was doing for I know that Nicole would, you know, Probably want to face a more clear headed Allen do that, but at this point, it's kind of after she's got what she's got here. She's going to have to work with it. It's like the old saying in life you don't, you, you get your, de your, your deal with the, with the hand you're dealt with, basically. Right, absolutely. I missed a big time forearm shot. Oh, now Allen be trying no. to go for a half and have Nicole landed on her feet and hit her with the knee! Right on the knee, on the jaw too. Yo! Nearly knocking her head off of her shoulders with that knee strike. Mm -hmm. And now Nicole has it. Northern Lights. Little Northern Lights there from Nicole here. This might be exactly what Nicole needed to get back into this contest. Irish whip. Indeed. Hammerlock. No, back elbow. Allen B with the back elbow. Now, what the hell? Oh my suplex. God! Ah! End of heartache! That damn suplex long blower. Now Allen B with that elbow drop of her own. Two. No. No, after that combination and the heartache into the elbow drop. Nicole Natasha kicks out again. Allen B trying to catch her breath here. Now going back on the attack. Irish whip, collar and elbow, but pushed away by Nicole. Nicole throws that will be into the corner. Whoa. Oh, she missed. I was, oh. That was gonna be a horrible landing. Oh, and now that's gonna cost her. Because now Allen B's gonna go. What be doing here? The throw through splash. Beautiful splash there for Allen B into the cover. No! That's a two count again. Another near fall in this main event. A signature Allen well, Since we're just, we're, we're almost nearing pure engagement, this, this has got a lot riding on here. Absolutely. Neither woman can afford a loss. No, oh, this close to pure engagement at this point. Mm hmm. Oh, wait a second, Nicole has Slice bread number two! Slice bread number two! Another one two. Two. No! And homage to one of the best cruiserweights ever, Grace of Fed Ring, the deep Ryan Kendrick. And now has her up against the ropes, Irish whip, looking for a drop kick, nobody home there. And there's a backstabber oh. from Allen B. Ugh. The hook of the leg, the two, but again, it's still not enough. Oh, man. I know. A heavy forearm. Say what, kick to the gut. Say what you will about Allen making the state right now. She's proving that she's still as good as she ever was inside of that wrestling ring. Block bar! She's never lost a step. What? There's another lung blower there from two. No! Oh! oh. God. If Allen B wasn't in that in that mindset, could we be seeing Allen B Martin as possibly the next Wildcats champion? At this point, I believe so. But again, it's she's got to stay in it. 
because Nicole is oh, still on top. Argentan, bomb! He wasn't in the ropes. That this match might have been over there. I'm not entirely sure. Jesus. Albi now getting back to her feet slowly but surely. But oh. now. Oh! Oh! Arabian press! To the outside! I'm paying homage to arguably one of the craziest wrestlers in, in wrestling history, Sabu! Omnicidal, genocidal, suicidal maniac. you watch that FMW, Dark Side of the Ring, you'll just, you'll just know that it, even, he, even he's not that crazy. One, two, oh, and three! Oh, Just a two. That's the end of the game. 75% body to die. True. Alright. Oh, Alan B. Putting our hole onto the top rope. What the hell? Is she gonna go for Superplex? I don't. Oh, she, wait a minute. Oh, no, oh, she's going for fly! Spanish fly! That might be a fly for. Two! Oh, no, no, no! The shoulder was up! Just so close! We are seeing... Man, I would be... I've hit damn near everything and she's still kicking out. We are seeing an absolute banger of a main event here at Wildcats 174. Oh, God. I don't know with the back body drop. Missed on the kick. Whoa. Oh! A kick to the back. A kick to the spine. Iron kick to the corner. Looking for that splash again. Me. Roll yes, through. He is. Splash! Got it. Own version of Rolling Thunder. Uh, she's not done though. Letting you go out, but going to the top row. What you got in mind here? Slowly but surely. Cutie pie for go! No, went for it. The cutie pie press. Nobody was home. And now the call. The judge. Oh my God. Driver does not get the job done. Man, any sense of the word, these two are proving their statement that they could be the next Wildcats champion here in this matchup. Without a doubt, both of these women oh. proving why that this big seed has not passed them by just yet. Away in hell. Okay. Oh, Gets out of it there. How's it? Spybuster! Bye! Spine on the pine, sit down, cover! Go! Two! Gee, that's a vicious spine on the pine! Does either woman have left at this point? That is a serious question. Yeah, to ask DDT! Oh, DDT! Stopping the corner. Fight tracks. We gotta be near 20 minutes in this main event matchup. They're throwing everything and anything they can. Oh, On B. Oh. Nobody home though. Hazard, another oh. fall away slam. The fall away slam there from Nicole here. I want to get that to the There's a big time. Oh, arm fall on there from, from Nicole. Throws Allen B to the ropes. Oh. Flash. In a minute. Crossbody is not there. Hazard up against Samoan. No. Has it oh elbows. no, LB gets out of it. Hey guys, I'm back. I'm back. Sorry about that. Sorry about that being a long phone call. I just got some very important news. What happened? Uh, something I can't really show. Okay. Understandable. Oh. Double oh, Northern Lights! Northern Lights. Northern Lights there. No. Two That's counts. like two counts. Back Let, and, let's just let's just say uh, some uh, chess pieces are in motion. Really? Yeah. It's interesting. Well, anyway, oh back to the contest. Wait a minute! Oh, oh look at that! Torillo press. Torillo press there from the Cole Natasha. Alibi was trying to get to the outside, thinking he would be safe, but that turned out not to be the case with the Cole. Look that forearm. Has a rock into the corner. Alright, 
Right in there. Oh, no. I just, that one be got in mind oh, here. Oh, no. What, what is, is this? Oh, God. Inverted. Inverted. Su yeah. Inverted superplex. Inverted superplex. You know, that Whoa. one be. Oh, dear. That might cost I think her. she took too no, long. Well, she, she might have. No, it's not hanging in there. Third time. They, Third time the charm here. No, Dave! No! The knees were up! And now the call! No, oh, Jesus! Oh, I have face bust. That double wing yeah. face buster. The wings of love, as she calls it. The wings of love that could propel her. But she's. Oh, she's had. Oh, it's the ring! You think of that? For the golden shot. Got it! Oh my it. gosh, he hit all of it! That shot, that's it! Well, it's it. it. All day. It's over. Nicole Natasha, please book 74 the winner. You have to give credit to Alan B. Martin. That was a hell of a fight. Oh, that was a freaking movie. Both women bringing their absolute A game here tonight. Even though that Alan B., again, we've stated, not all there mentally. That doesn't. That does not hinder the fighting spirit of one Alan B. Martin whatsoever. What a war we just witnessed. Both women throwing every single last big shot they could, but at the end, it goes to Nicole Natasha. The, the wings of the, 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 the love golden the, shot, I say, golden shot combo. Yeah, that was ball game. The wings of love set it up perfectly for the, for the golden shot. And remember, Due to remember, she still is the holder of the Rumble Roses case. So, are we looking at the next Wildcats champion? Possible, but it's the ending right here. Alan B was going to go for that that splash, but Nicole picked up the legs. That third time was not for enough time to hit her with. Or wasn't the charm, which set up perfectly for the wings of love. Bang! Right on the face, and then from the to finish it off. Golden shot. Yeah. And this night, it hits bullseye. Watch this, halfway across the ring as well. Halfway across the ring, doesn't matter for Nicole. I think of you. The money. That was academic. That was it. What a, what a match to end Wildcats 174. Nicole pretty much showing why she holds that Rumble Rose's case. And if you are a woman here in Wildcats, you hold that, if you hold that main belt, Amber, you better have very, you better have very, very, very watchful eyes on this woman right here. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's going to do it for us here at Wildcats 174. Oh, what the fuck? You fucking bitch! Uh, you fucking the, bitch! Uh, of course. Of course. Think of the devil and she shall appear. Cheap shot, super kick from Amber Stevens. Uh, why would we think this episode would have ended any differently than Amber being the uh, absolute is, ego man? Veronica! Wait a minute, wait a minute! Wait a minute. Go for GTS and uh, Amber the in. Damn it. AMS! Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, this is the world champion we are. First and other super kick. The reality this division faces. Well, hmm. this... Egotist, backstabbing, liar, deceptive, you know what is champion. Well, that's She's a shell of a former self. And I'm not on about the athlete, I'm on about the person. Come to my house, baby, take control now.